Hello everybody, this is Command Block Kid here, and today we're going to be showing you how to use the replace item command. So, first things first, you want to open up your chat window by hitting slash, or get a command block out, and start typing in the parameters. So I'll so I'll tell you what all, all the parameters mean, stuff like that, most of them, I know. But if you've got anything that you know of that I don't, I will happily try out the command and now we'll see if it works. Alright? So, on to the command. So I'm going to do a command slash replace item entity your username or at p at r at a at e at s or whatever slot dot let's do hot bar and let's do all right, Minecraft, and let's do, uh, let's give ourselves, um, not command block, let's give ourselves, um, <laughs> glass. One, zero, there, all right. Alright, so we're going to go over all this stuff here. So replace item. That is your, uh, that is the star of the command. Entity uh, states a living Minecraft object or like something that is not a block. It could be a minecart, for example. That's considered an entity. The player is also considered an entity and all other, and all animals and monsters and whatnot. All right, and then your username. The username is is shown. Slot dot hotbar dot eight. Now I'm gonna let you take a guess. Is it right here or is it right here? I'm gonna give you a few seconds to think about that. All right. So if you have already uh, thought what you were going to say. I want to tell you this. If you guess this one, you're actually wrong. Alright, now many of you are going right now, what? How is that wrong? So, this is actually computer language that we're going here now. So, the first, it doesn't start at one like we do. We normally start uh, numbers off at one. The computer starts it off at zero. So this would be zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, if you've gotten any confusion, let me know in the comments, and I will try my best to clear the confusion. So then we're gonna have Minecraft glass. So this replaces, so it has glass in that area. It's kind of like the give command, basically. Once you hit the Minecraft glass part, or Minecraft, and then colon and then something one states the amount and zero states whether or not it is uh, what data it is or damage well for some items it's damage for others it's just different blocks and you know and there so that's a command right there so command set replace item edge t command block kid slot dot hop r dot eight Minecraft glass one zero. There, that's a mouthful. So basically you for command blocks you don't need the slash, but for chat commands you do. So let's put a a block right there. And it replaces a these slot dot hop r dot eight with one glass. Like so. That's pretty cool. I'm going to put glass right here so that I know what command this is in the future. Alright, now we're going to go over some other commands that I have. Uh, this one here is a replace I am command. And this time it replaces it with chests. I want to move the chests. And I'm going to grab the glass again. And just so I don't forget, I'm going to put up on our, like, memorial wall, the chest, the glass, and there's one more that we're going to be doing. Alright, 
Now there's one more that I that I think it's this one here. Oh, that's another one. So this time it changes it a little. Slot dot armor dot chest. That actually states your armor here. My chest plate. Oh and how do I look? Stay how I look in the comments, alright? If you'd like. Alright, so we're gonna put that on our uh we're gonna have to get an armor stand at some point. Not in the video, but you know. So that gives us armor. This one gives us a potion of strength. Like so. So this time it says Minecraft Potion one zero and in uh, curly brackets potion colon strength. It's actually pretty easy. Most of the stuff here is from the give command. And that's actually quite easy. Just so we can tell what commands we've done. Here, I'm just gonna rotate that. Just so I don't get confused. Alright. So, that's about the end of this video here. Hope you all enjoyed it. And if you've got any questions, concerns, anything like that, please let me know in the comments. I should respond to you within about a month. Alright? I know I'm have, I've been on a tight schedule lately. But anyways, that is the end of this video here. Hope you all enjoyed it. And I'll see you in the next video. Oh, one more thing before I end the video. This version is in 1.12.2. So if you're playing any versions older or newer or like that, you're gonna find you might find some differences. Just give me a heads up. And also some of the commands that I stated, like the potion command, um, it cannot uh, be done in the pocket version edition, like your smartphone or your uh, phone, your smartphone or your tablet, something like that. And yeah, so some of the stuff can be supported. I will. I might be stating what it what is supported, but I won't be uh, saying it here. I'm not gonna. I'm probably not. But anyways, this is the end of this video here. Hope you all enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.